Hey Fuzzies, it's Janice. Welcome back to my channel. If you're an offender for the first time, welcome. If you're an habitual offender, welcome back. <laughs> now, I know it's funny, but people have these New Year's resolutions and blah, 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 and da dee da dee da How many people actually keep it? I'm waiting. <laughs> None. That's why I don't make them anymore. <laughs> I make nothing because if I do that, that means I have to promise myself I have to do something and I don't like to keep promises to myself, so I don't do it anymore. So I made a, a bucket list. No, I didn't. <laughs> like, what's mine going to say? My bucket list says, I have more than eight kids. Check. <laughs> have more than three husbands. Or three marriages. <laughs> Be a total bitch by practice. Check. <laughs> Not having a job for more than 11 years. Check. Come on, people. Bucket list. Just do it. You don't need a list. Just do what's ever on your mind and your heart. Or I would have been screwed a long time ago. <laughs> Wait a minute. I was. <laughs> but... Oh my goodness, yeah, it's been a day. I'm not feeling well. I have a fever. Can you tell? I can feel it. I have a fever. I have been vomiting everywhere and anywhere. Um, I haven't eaten all day because I can't hold anything down. Um, I drank some water. That's what I've been doing today is drinking water. But I do have a fever. And, and I promised myself I was going to do YouTube every day. Every day. Until I can't do it anymore. Um, <sighs> yes, I'm in my bathroom because it's the only place that's peace and quiet. If people think you're taking a dump, ain't nobody going to come in here and interrupt you. But as soon as you get in that bathtub, everybody wants to be in here. they got to tell you something. <laughs> All my girls, I swear to God. Right down to the last one comes in here. My 35-year-old would come in here. I would be in the bathtub. She'd sit on the floor. <laughs> Mom, i got to tell you something. Do you mind? I'm trying to take a bath here. i got to wash my ass. No, nope, she'd sit right there <laughs> and, got, and talk about the day. I was like, oh, my goodness. When do I ever get peace and quiet? When you're a mother, you never get any peace or quiet, no matter what. And I mean no matter what. Oh, my goodness. My girls, just like their mother. <laughs> but I never went into my mother's bathroom when she was taking a bath. You just don't do it. You just don't do it. You can't handle it. <laughs> no, you don't do that. That's privacy. Like, kids go in their parents' bedroom nowadays. Why? They don't have permission, my my kids aren't weren't allowed to go in my bedroom without asking or like sending to go get something. But other than that, no, 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 no. You didn't ask your parents how much they made, how old they are, do they have life insurance? You don't. You, no, you didn't ask your parents that. That was that was their business, not a child's business. But nowadays, they got ten year olds that are freaking want to be business people. <laughs> They gotta know everything about their parents. No, you don't. No, you don't. There's just some things that are left, better left unsaid, or told, or shown. <laughs> you just don't do it. Eh, eh, eh. Your parents' privacy is their business, <laughs> is their stuff. You don't need to know about their stuff. <laughs> I don't know about my parents anymore because <laughs> both my parents are gone. There's nothing to laugh about, but still, I don't think I. Oh, no. Delete, delete, I don't get it out of my head, delete, I don't want to see it, don't want to hear about it. Can you imagine? No, I couldn't, mm -mm. no, walking in when my parents are doing it, no, nope. that's why we weren't allowed in their bedroom. <laughs> we didn't want to know, we didn't want to know what was going on, what they were hiding, what they had in there, didn't care. My biggest thing was when was my next tree, the highest tree I was going to climb, it wasn't going into my parents' bedroom and looking through their stuff. Oh, my goodness. 
and all these channels nowadays on YouTube, these um, call them reacting channels, um, drama channels. But I do like me some Peter Munn. I do look him up. He's a he's a um, beauty guru, but he also does book um, um, readings and um, book. Uh, what do you call those book club things? What books are good to read? He does those too. So if you want something interesting, his name is Peter Mon. Peter Mon, M O N N. And um, oh, his little Chihuahua Pee Pee. He passed away over the weekend, last weekend. So send send prayers to Peter Mon because Pee Pee was his his bestest friend in the whole world. So sorry to hear they lost. His best friend. I'm not joking either because pets are like um, the, the best, the family members. They're family members no matter which way you look at it because you take care of them just like you would take care of a child. So, yeah. Throw them a prayer. Throw them a, um, you know, a sympathy. Tell them that you're sorry that you lost Pee Pee because Pee Pee was pretty, pretty old and he's had him for a while. So, I feel, ba I feel bad for him. <sighs> yeah. YouTube says 10 minutes. I say six. I don't care. Whatever I have to say, that's what I'm going to say. I'm not timing anything. But yeah, look up Peter Mon. Peter, M-O-N-N. -N. He has like four or five YouTube channels. One of them's reviews on stuff. And the other one's for his um, beauty guru drama channels. And, and two book channels. And something else. I can't remember the something else. But I know there's something else. There's five, four or five. I can't remember. But he, he's a pretty busy man. So look him up. And um, Chrissy and um, Cassandra's channel. Look them up. They're funny. <laughs> They're too funny wise. I'm telling you. <laughs> you got to check them out. And they have a YouTube channel, too, so check it out. So, that's all I got to say today. Um, I'll see you tomorrow because psh, I'm going to be here until this face gets 1,000 subscribers. In the spring and the summer is going to be different. In the wintertime, I don't like to go outside. I don't like cold. Hey, as you get older, you don't want to go outside unless you're snowmobiling. Oh, we don't have a snowmobile. My husband does, but I don't. I used to have one. We used to go out all the time. So I'm thinking about maybe, nah, it's just too damn cold outside. I don't even like to go out there and, and get in my car when it's warmed up. The electric starter warms it up. I don't even like to go from the door to the door <laughs> to get cold people. I hate cold. I loved it when I was a kid. But as you get older, you just like, I don't think so. I really don't think so. I don't think I can do it. So, you know what? I go out with flip-flops and a damn goddamn um, sweatshirt. No wonder I'm cold. No, I don't. <laughs> yeah, I do. <laughs> I go out with a sweatshirt. But the flip-flops, now I go out with, um, um, what do you call those things? Oh, what do you call those shoes <laughs> that look like a, oh my goodness, I can't remember the damn name of the shoes. See, this is what age gets you in sickness. I'm also sick, so I don't, Crocs, there you go. <laughs> See, it's Croc of shit. My winter Crocs I wear. So, yeah. But I did buy me some uh, mud boots the other day. So, they're pretty warm when I went outside in the... Because we really don't have snow snow. It's more like mud, sleet, and mud. So there's not too much snow. There's a lot of ice this morning on our road. Sliding down the road. Not really. But there's ice. They come to um do our road. That Our road's a secondary road or a third dairy road or whatever you want to call it. Because they don't get to us until 3 o'clock in the afternoon when the bus comes. <laughs> And then you have to go down the hill. Then you had to come back up the hill. This morning was bad. I mean, I just put it in neutral and just went down the hill. Do you know, down our hill, we put it in neutral. You can go 57 miles an hour to the bottom. That's how steep our hill is. Our hill's like this. Yeah. That's what I thought, too. Well, I'm just talking out of my mouth right now. <laughs> I didn't know what to say on that one. 
So I'll let y'all go, and you guys have a great night. <laughs> Late.